Hey, I'm, I hope it's loud enough for you to hear me over the traffic in the horrible Columbus Circle. Right here. Horrible Columbus. Right here. And I'm reading a book. Thanks for joining me. This is the Christopher, the Ogre Cologer. It's over! It's over! Colonization should be over! Hero worship should be over! Especially genociders, liars, and enslavers like horrible Cl Christopher Columbus. And so this book, Christopher the Ogre Cologer, It's Over! is written by Rebel Dita the Fearless and Dr. Sue. And so thank you for joining me. Christopher the Ogre Cologer. It's over! To Berta Caceres. And all children in occupied lands for truth. More than 500 years ago, across the wide ocean A, there lived a king and a queen. So greedy were they. Eurolandia is what their home was called, right by the sea. Oh, they hoarded everything there as far as the eye could see rivers and land and gold shore to shore, mountains and cows, yet they wanted much more. This is not half enough, they'd huff and they'd hum, and they wouldn't be happy till they owned every last crumb. To take and to take, each day more and more, they had 100 ogres to steal and explore. With their big, huge arms, they'd hoard everything. These ogres snatched birds, flying free with the wind. And just, oh, sorry. Check it out. And just as expected, the day finally arrived when those greedy king's well ran completely dry. No more land or animals left for them to take. Not even a flake of old yucky fruitcake. Dead. But then a thought occurred to those wicked kings. Why don't we just go steal other people's things? To faraway lands, that's where we, our ogres must go. Why we're just thinking of this, we simply don't know. And to, and to head this big job, the kings would now choose their most trusty ogre. And they asked themselves, Who? But the answer was easy. A minute it took. They knew just the ogre. It would make history books. We've made our decision, the evil kings roared. He's the biggest, the baddest, by all ogres adored. He's, am he's ambitious, and malicious, and totally vicious. Ruthless and heartless, and savagely capricious. Christopher Cologer! We kings do choose you! This, there isn't just an ogre. There just isn't an ogre who steals like you do. Go to faraway lands and bring us more gold. We want more of everything. Land, cloud, birds, lots more. We know they've got riches and treasure galore. So in the name of our lord, we choose you to explore. You see, the royal family here choosing their ogre, Christopher Kologer.
the ogre, Kologer, in the blink of an eye, set sail for new land. Didn't even ask why. He always craved stardom. And this was his chance. I'll be famous! With a song and a dance. And with 100 ogres, Kologer sailed Ocean A. So much sea was so grueling that he barfed all the way. <laughs> oh, boo! Gross! It's pretty gross, isn't it? Until finally, one day, in October, they could not believe their eyes. What a surprise it was. They had reached paradise. Beautiful clouds, mountains so grand, jewelry, gold, architecture, well planned, majestic big jaguars, and birds in the sky. Full markets and rivers, what beauty, oh my. Their millions of children ran free like the breeze, playing so happy, right next to the sea. And Kaloger blinked twice, his eyes opened wide. My, my eyes must be tricking me. They're going side to side. I just can't believe it. Could this all be true? I'd rather not think it. Mm, I've got work to do. I'll steal and I'll steal, until I can't steal no more. I'll be famous! He screeched, you will not ignore. The Ogre Kologer read his first Ogre command, and began to speak with a swish of his hand. From this moment, no. From this moment on, you'll do as I say. Get used to it, kids. No, don't, don't get used to it. Get used to it, kids, cause I'm here to stay. You'll all work for me, and you'll do it for free. You'll bow to my ways. This is how we'll now be. Give me all of your gold, and your mountains, your cakes, your clouds, and your books, and all of your lakes. Everything by decree is now mine. My kings handpicked me, and it's my time to shine. Ah. And listen, you Abyayalans, and heed my advice, or you'll be quite sorry. I won't say it twice. You must learn my language and worship my king. Because henceforth, I put, I pull all of the strings. I'm Christopher the Ogre Kologer. I'll be famous one day. They'll say I was great in every which way. I'll make books say I was perfect, even my ugliest tooth. Cause here, from here on out, I prohibit you from telling the truth. I used to make, I used to make sure that from each pair of lips, I need to make sure that from each pair of lips comes only a great story of my three big ships. And anyone who dare call me an ogre instead will regret it when I scream, off with his head. Up with his head! The children and parents of Adyayala were steaming. If you think we'll obey, you must be daydreaming! And to defend Mother Earth, they knew what was right. So the children put up the greatest of fights. They didn't want ogres stealing their land, but ogres were mean, and they chose to expand. You see that? Christopher the Ogre Kologer prohibits saying, 
I prohibit you from telling the truth. Is it okay to prohibit the truth? You know what prohibit means? It means stop. No, you can't tell the truth. That's not good. That's what a bully would say. So they can do bad things to people. And oh, how sad the scene was. Oh, no. Kaloger's crew brought guns, rifles, and sickness. Children and parents now suffered great illness. Millions of Avyayalans fell to the ground, and the emptiness made the most saddening sound of loss. Millions of Avyayalans fell to the ground. No. But those awful ogres, they felt no remorse about what they did, a pure show of force. Now we can see how Kaloger began to loot Abhyayala, his original plan. His dastardly ogres had all come prepared to take all they could. Nothing was spared. I have to set up my... Make sure you can see Christopher the Ogre Kaloger in the background here. They put jaguars and mountains with all of the gold in dirty great ships to later be sold. They looted the rivers and took every bird. They burnt all their great books. It was completely absurd. I give you my word. I'm honest and true. Believe what I say, unlike you know who. Ogres took children's smiles. Their grandparents' styles. The breeze of the sea and the birds over water, like the wind flying free. They stole everything. We're not sad one bit. No, truth be told, so much beauty, Abhyayala had to its name, that Kaloger decided he needed more arms to lay claim. And so he yelled, Bring me more people, more girls and boys, and force them to work for me at my employ. And Kaloger's ogres went in no time to where they committed another unforgivable crime. Africa the Beautiful was the name of the land. For it, another horrible fate the ogres had planned. From there to Abiyala, they took children in big, ugly ships, held captive in chains round all of their hips. Such was how, despite the children's bravery, these ogres put millions of them in slavery. This story of Kaloger has not often been heard, but I'm telling the truth, this really occurred. If you've never heard it before, please do not despair. It's because Christopher Kaloger made truth something you couldn't declare. He made sure every book would spread these tall tales. They, that the greatest admiral he was, an explorer who sails the great ocean blue and from Genoa hails. So over the years, people came to believe he discovered the new land. Millions he deceived. They thought of him as brave. He had such daring do. They called him bold and super smart. 
too. It was all a big lie. He was none of those things. Sorry, Kologer. The truth sometimes stings. Discovering a place? What a doofus he was. You know what they say, silly is as silly does. 100 million people in Agayala already existed over thousands of years. They had beautifully persisted. It's been about 500 years since that day in midfall when Kologer usurped Abyayala once and for all. And though the ogre Kologer isn't around anymore, his fifths and his lies remain like before. You might see them in monuments like this.